at Samla. Listen, I've Here got another go. thing to say. You know what? Uh, Let's uh, do this again. Camera on me. Right. You know what? We were talking about this topic a second ago. Players are always crying about burnout, right? What they say is like, they make it sound like they should only play one week every month and the rest of the time, they're just going to play some scrims and they're going to boot camp. And it's going to give us a higher level of Counter-Strike. That's what they keep telling us, right? That's what's going to make the game really, really good. But I've seen this time and time again now. So I've just seen Astralis come out of this huge boot camp, all this time out. And then what happens? They just get banged out by Complexity, no name team. And then they lose now on maps that they're home maps to a team that they always have owned. It seemed like they were basically their little brothers that they were just giving wedgies to and all sorts of, I think I was a nookie actually, but whatever. They're just literally wrecking those guys. That's because they haven't played. Like, what do you think you get paid $20,000 a month to do? It's not to play one week of official games and a bunch of scrims and some DM. Like, this is the thing. A boot camp is brilliant to fix some problems, to get some tactics going, to actually have like a couple of weeks so you've got everything fine-tuned, but don't forget about your performance level because your performance level comes from playing tournaments. You can't simulate a match environment it's called ring rust in mma it's called match fitness in any other traditional sport so what i would say is go and look at the circuit we have listen it's a very intense circuit it's really really high level if you want to be at the top there but go look at any of the other traditional sports like how about tennis those guys fly around the whole world they go on more continents than you guys do and they still maintain the highest performance a level overall average of practically any sport I've ever seen. And one of the reasons why is they're not messing around in the meantime. So if you want to be someone who complains about burnout or I don't have everything perfect the way I want it to be, then I better see you in bed at 10 p.m. I don't want to see you in the club with me at 4 a.m. saying, can we keep this thing open another hour? Here's another Rivna. Yeah, you, you hear what I'm saying. <laughs> I, I don't want to see you drinking a certain energy drink at 10 p.m. at night, going into your last map and then complaining you can't get any sleep because of jet lag. You better take care of your body. You better take care of your mind. You better take care of everything. Be responsible. And then we can start talking about is the circuit too packed? Because at the moment, when I see you guys go home, I actually hope you go home because I don't see you come back at the world-class level. Team Liquid didn't do it. Astralis didn't do it. Let's actually see you put your money where your mouth is if these boot camps are helping so much, boys. That's it.